Hello everyone, welcome to Mocking Sapien. My name is Tanay and today we are going to talk about when the coronavirus vaccine might come out. So just let me give you a disclaimer that I'm not guaranteeing anything that it will come now only or it has come only or anything like that. Otherwise you guys will start off promise kiya tha kaha pe hai vaccine. So I'm just reading out the news. Hum koi Ramdev Baba to hai nahi ki koi vaccine bana diya ya dawa bana di. और बोले कि हाँ हंड्रेड परसेंट इफेक्टिव कोरोनिल कोरोना की दवाई कोरोनिल और स्वासारी को हम लॉन्च करने जा रहे हैं दिल्ली से लेकर के अहमदाबाद से लेकर के मेरठ से लेकर के देश के कई शहरों में की गई क्लिनिकल कंट्रोल स्टडी उसमें भी हंड्रेड परसेंट पेशेंट्स की रिकवरी हुई एक भी डेथ नहीं हुई क्लिनिकल कंट्रोल स्टडी सर नॉट गिविंग एनी गारंटीज दिस is what from the news i'm saying nothing else and before i start this video i would like to tell you all to stay away from any kind of you know coronavirus cures where people tell you that do this or do that and then coronavirus will be cured please stay away from such news there is no such cure till now because of all these uh, kind of news you end up not taking a lot of precautions and bhai uske baad to you know what happens now what is basically a vaccine a vaccine is a weakened kind of virus or dead virus of the virus you want protection against so they inject that dead or weakened virus into your body so your immune system gets ready in case the actual virus comes into your body so you get that protection so this is basically a vaccine a weakened or dead virus of the virus you want protection against a vaccine can give you protection against a particular kind of virus for a few months or a few years or a lifetime it depends from vaccine to vaccine so as you can see the chart over here you can see which vaccine is you know is effective for how long for few months or years or something and coronavirus vaccine is said to be like there are various things regarding it that 3 months it will be more effective 6 months or a year so you don't know exactly how much it is but don't you think the vaccine making is taking too much time do you know why is that happening pakistan pakistan is reducing the effectiveness of vaccine making through nanotechnology pakistan is the main cause for everything pakistan that is a joke clinical control study vaccine making is a very lengthy process it might take years altogether for it to be made like on an average it takes 10 years for a vaccine to be made 2 years go in research only like research mein jata hai then they come into pre clinical trials and then the uh, actual uh, human trials and that like, uh, 10 years but in coronavirus they, they are taking additional efforts and they are taking a lot of risks so that they can make it available in the market because a lot of that's happening to throughout the world and there's utter chaos because of this virus so researchers and vaccine developing companies are taking additional efforts in this so there are basically five steps in making vaccine so what you basically need is a bartan which is should be of this size then you need some water in a glass you fill it and then you need some mesh in order to catch the virus so like it gets stuck in this so this is what you need to do catch the virus and then you take this you pour it in so the water and the bartan setup you need to keep it ready in your house as you go near some place where there is virus and catch it put it in a polythene bag you have to wrap it up real nice and then what you do is you take this and then you empty it and then you boil it experts say that you need to boil it for at least 10 minutes in order it to die or weaken you know so you take this after cooling it put it in and then you have this done so <laughs> like they use such words only that you know expert says this or expert say that science says this or science says that <laughs> so this is the whole procedure pura boil karke mar ke piho mast ho gaya kaam finish <laughs> clinical control study so actually there is a it's a five step process in which uh, the first one is pre clinical trials which in which they take tests on animals and all then the phase 1 in which they take trials on humans who are healthy and they check the dosage how much dose should you give 
then the safety of the vaccine and then the immune response so that your body is producing antibodies or T cells or no. Then phase two is the same thing they do in different age groups and it's in larger in number. And then there is phase three in which they do it on thousands of people and check how effective is it. And then if all these go successful, then it gets approved. Clinical control study. Every phase takes two months, three months altogether, like in terms of coronavirus, two to three months it will take for every phase to complete. For emergency situations, companies do phase one and two together or two and three together so that they can speed up the process of vaccine making while considering the safety. Okay, not just like, hey, karo, ghar pe to nahi bana rahe. So there are basically four companies in phase four and one company which has been approved. So in phase four, there is AstraZeneca in collaboration with the Oxford University to which the Serum Institute has tied up with in order to produce the vaccines that I'll get back to later on in the video. That the second one is Wuhan Institute of Biological Products. Where the virus started. Third one is Sinovac. And the fourth one is Murdoch Children's Research Institute. Over here, children make vaccines. You know, Generation Z, I tell you, very smart. So these kids are coming and they're developing vaccine. It's such a huge breakthrough in the thing. Okay, check it. It's just a normal institute. So let's move on. <laughs> and there is one which is approved. <laughs> Guess which one it is. From which country it is. <laughs> China. <laughs> China made the virus and has the vaccine for the virus already. <laughs> so the company's name is CanSino Biologics. So they have tied up with the military and they are already giving vaccines to the military in this case. So China may virus bhi nikla, unka vaccine bhi nikla. Hamari to lage pade, must. Must look at Clinical control study. Now let's come to India. First, I want to start with is Covaxin. Covaxin, this, bhai, they started their clinical trials in July, like two weeks back, in the mid of July, and they were planning to launch the vaccine on 15th of August. Bhai, how did they get this unrealistic thing? I don't know. Like other companies who are on the stage on the phase three and all, they had started their trials on in March. In March, they had started the trial and still they didn't guarantee anything that, that this time it will come out or something. Covaxin, bhai, ek mahine mein, he, bana ke must. They are doing my only procedure. Bartan mein paane dal ke, <laughs> oh, ek mahine mein khatam. What fucking thing was that? that he, ho gaya khatam. Bana diya ek mahine mein, launch directly. 15 August, independence from coronavirus. I don't think Baba Ramdev also took so less time to, you know, make that coronil. Kya kya dala coronil. Clinical control study. Now let's come to Serum and Oxford. So Serum is a very huge company in India. It's one of the biggest manufacturers of vaccine all over the world. So Oxford had its phase one trials recently and then they were quite successful. It was able to stimulate an immune response and produce antibodies and T cells and it was safe also. So antibodies and T-cells both are required in fighting the virus. Antibodies is normally what your body produces and T-cells is also the same thing, but it stays in your body for a longer time and it's produced in the thymus gland. Both of them combined are more effective in fighting a virus. So I'm not gonna get into the details of it, but T-cells are very important. Even antibodies are, even T cells are very important in fighting a virus. According to Adar Kunawala, the owner of Serum Institute, the, he said that around two months it will take for the phase three trials to complete. And by November, if it all goes well, then by November, they'll be ready with the vaccine. And by the end of this year, they'll be manufacturing a lot of vaccines and it'll be made available in the market. And if everything goes well in the phase three trials, then they will launch the vaccine in the first quarter of 2021, which is quite fast. So hopefully there will be positive results and maybe we'll get to see something good coming out of it. Initially, it will be given only in high risk areas like Mumbai, Pune, where it's affected very badly. And afterwards, they'll move to normal production and give it everywhere else. So we hope to see some positive results by 2021 early. If not, then apna to, I told you the procedure. Bartan, Pani, virus, boil, drink the order. Coronavirus, finish. You are immune for a lifetime. But let's not raise our hopes also too much and continue with our social distancing and the precautions which we are taking regularly. Continue doing that. Vaccine aega, tab aega, dekhenge. Kya hota hai? 
थैंक यू एवरीवन फॉर वाचिंग द वीडियो सी यू गाइस इन द नेक्स्ट वन बाय बाय क्लिनिकल कंट्रोल स्टडी